that's me. Hey guys, so long time no see since we did a video like this, okay? I'm coming to y'all raw, uncut. The hair is doing what it wants to. I'm doing what it wants to. <laughs> um, yeah, I am going to do a relaxer touch up video, as y'all can see. My hair is relaxed, but my roots, they need a touch up. Like, I've been dragging it, I've been stretching it for six months now. The last time I got a relaxer was April. April 22nd. When people wear it, I feel like crazy. <laughs> it was April 22nd. And yeah, I haven't got a relaxer since. So I've been stretching and keeping it in protective styles. Ooh, ooh, ooh. When I got my ponytail installed, I'll link the video, the clip here. I got my hair pressed out. But when I tell y'all that Deja was like, yo, your roots are like way too thick. And it's like, yeah, sorry about that girl. And then I wanted to sleep ponytail on top of that. Like that was crazy. That was a crazy request. But she got it done. She got it done. So yeah, today we're going to do our relaxer okay so i've never tried this brand before but i was just like it's just a touch up you know so this is pro can i can i read this is the mega growth super strength and it says it is a complete one touch application and i think the girl is cute okay it's giving what it needs to gauge that's what i that's what i want to give okay so i got her why is the camera moving all the way over like what tracking the face on the box get it together anyways so yeah this is what we're going to do real quick it's literally 9 42 p.m and then you girl gotta work tomorrow i got two boxes just in case because y'all see how thick this head is i don't know but i have my healing ointment here because i don't have any vaseline i'm just going to trace my edges and my ears so that they don't burn then i'm gonna wash it out blow dry it and we're gonna call it a day we'll style it tomorrow you know what i'm saying i just need these roots to be straight and y'all when i was taking my locks out i literally chopped let me see if i can find the piece my hair is so freaking thick right now it don't make no sense i think this is it right here yep i chopped my hair right here y'all see that this is my edge. Like, this is as much as it is. Because I cut the whole braid on accident, y'all. Oh, my God. I was so... I was so devastated. I couldn't even talk about it. But, yeah. And so, I'm just going to put this on before I forget. Because I'm good for forgetting. And y'all will be in the comments. Freaking hair warriors. Y'all know how y'all do. Trying to tell me what I did wrong. Woo, woo, woo. Whatever. I've been trying my hardest not to scratch my head but uh yeah the way the girl been feeling it's like when you know you're not supposed to scratch your head that's when you want to scratch it the most and when you don't have to um make sure that you don't scratch your head you never do so if you're new here i'm sorry but if you're new here my name is serena hence the intro hence the channel name that's so arena you get it quite know that's how we are here period okay yeah let's get into the video here but i'm just gonna leave that part alone but as you can see the rest of the hair is untouched just the roots i got up in there okay and actually they knew what they were talking about because only one pack did this hole on my roots so we're gonna wait how long how long does it want me to wait uh english side please okay Coarse hair, 
application time, eight minutes. Sealing time, 12 minutes. So 12 minutes. Because it says a, to a maximum time of 20 minutes. So we're going to do 12 minutes. I look crazy. And that's my business. <laughs> but yeah, this is how I'm going to sit for now. I can already tell by how it's laying that it's, it, I got up in now. This is how the back looks. I can tell I got up in there. Nothing burns. We Gucci around here, okay? We real Gucci. Can't wait. Can't wait. And I'm not going to style it tonight. I'm just going to style it tomorrow. I just wanted to make sure that the relaxer and the washing and the blow drying was out the way by 11.15. And y'all, we're making great timing because it's only... 10 15. Look at that. 10 15. I'm doing it, baby. All right. I'm doing it. Period. I'm back because the timer, timer is up. Y'all seen it? And so now we got to rinse this out. I'm like, should I rinse it out in the sink downstairs or should I just use the, the tub right here? Again, nothing burns. I can just feel. That it's working, okay. Just know it's working. It don't burn like oh, get it out of me, get it out of me. But I feel it over here while I was itching. So we're gonna use this neutralizing shampoo until my the water that rinses out turns white, and then we're gonna use this neutralizing shampoo, and then we're gonna use leave-in condition. Well, this is leave-in strengthener, so this can go in after the fact. This is so ghetto, but my um, vlog camera died. So here's how we're looking after I came out of the sink, okay? The roots is straight, baby, finally. And so now I'm putting this Break Free Daily Leave-In Strengthener that was in the pack. I don't, I don't, I don't know what it is, but it says it's great before blow drying, um, olive oil shade, coconut proteins, um, apply daily to damaged hair, apply nightly for added moisture, um, after removing all traces of relaxer from the hair, apply from roots to ends, leave in to help start breakage, um, excellent before blow drying, whatever. We're just gonna cut her open and blow dry her out. And I'm gonna come back to y'all once I am done blow drying because this setup is real ghetto, but I just wanted to show y'all that I'm doing this before I blow dry my hair. And yeah, and this is the blow dryer that I use. I will link a similar one down below, but this is the best way for me to blow dry my hair. Can I clean it before I just showcase it or what? Um, this is the one that I use. Um, this style of blow dryer works best for me because my hair is so thick. So um, I just, this is when I section my hair into four sections and then I um, am able to just blow dry it seamlessly because it um, it's a brush and a blow dryer all in one. So I don't have to do the chase method or the round brush, all that. I do like the round brush, but only when I do it myself because um, when like I go to the salon and get the round brush, y'all, that thing be so hot, the freaking bristles of the freaking blow dryer be burning my scalp, yo. And they're like, it's okay, it's just a steam. No, girl, you're burning my scalp, literally. I'm on, on fire. I'm not tender-headed. I could take some pain, but that baby, that thing be hot. But anyways, I'm just rambling at this point. Let me blow dry my hair, and I'll see how when I'm done blow drying, because right now I still look crazy. Am I going to look crazy the whole video? <laughs>
All right, y'all, it is the next morning. I'm on my first break. For y'all know I work from home. Outside of YouTube, I work in the healthcare field. And so I'm on my first break. So I'm, I saw this trend on, um, well, this hack on um, TikTok. It's like called the Farrah Fawcett. So basically you just curl your hair up and then shake it out or wide tooth comb, but I don't have a wide tooth comb, but you curl it up and then you shake it out and it'll be like voluptuous, volumized curls. So we're going to try that out. I mean, it can't hurt. My hair is straight, but a little pizzazz would help bring it to life. So that's what I'm doing. Just following the comb with the flat iron so that my hair is straight. Well, sleek, but flipped up, if you get what I mean. Oh, that one did not go. Redo. Okay. Yeah, and it looks good. It looks healthy. I like how it looks. But yeah, she needed some definition because she was just flat. When I woke up this morning, I unwrapped it and I was like, oh, okay, girl. Look at you wrapping your hair, honey. And so, yeah, we giving her some personality real quick i need to film another youtube video today so it'd be good if my hair was already done real convenient you know when i'm shining but yeah a little youtube a little tiktok you can get your hairstyle done yourself honey you ain't gotta pay nobody you know what i'm saying but i'm just so lazy because my hair is so thick i hate hate doing it myself but girl you know how to do your own hair please just do your own and so that's what i did and i only used one box they knew what they were talking about with that so that was good that was good and i have another one for in a few months when i need to redo it let's do this side but yeah y'all i was gonna make this video a voiceover but i was like girl just talk to the camera it's less to edit just chop that thing up you know what i'm saying Y'all seem real interested in my hair. I don't know why. It's just hair. But hey. If y'all like it, I love it. Yeah, that's going to be a good one when I comb it out. You see how thick that thing is? You see how tight that curl is right now? It's on the flick of the wrist. I know right now y'all like, what are you doing? Trust me. Well, shoot. I'm trusting myself because I've never done it this way. But... Uh, it don't look like it's had any fails online, so we're gonna keep it rolling. We're gonna keep the motherfucker rolling. <laughs> that looks like my grandma. She looks like this, but she wears um rollers to do it. She doesn't put heat on her hair, but I just looked like her real quick with that flip right there in the front. Okay, girl. Y'all see it? And I love this flat iron. I don't even know what it's called. What, uh, wavy talk, which is crazy because it's a straightener, but it's called wavy talk. And my sister got it for me for Christmas because I told her I needed a good, good titanium flat iron, and she delivered. Okay, period. And that was Christmas last year, I believe. Yeah, I think so. I was going through my pictures last night. Y'all had 17,000 pictures in my phone. That's actually ridiculous. And don't get me started on video because y'all know I take hella content. So all my stuff is in my phone, in my iPad, and I share an iCloud on both. I was thinking about making another iCloud, but that's just too much. That's too many passwords to keep up with. All that. I ain't, I ain't with all that. If I wasn't a content creator, I'd probably have a track phone, baby, and a Polaroid camera, and living in a van. Okay? I'm a very simple girl. I don't need much to survive. All right, here we go. This looks cute already. Like, what? This is what I've seen people doing online. Damn, with my freaking neck, why don't you? Oh, it's so cute. What? 
Bye. Bye. This is so cute. Oh, this is cute, y'all. What? Let me lay my edges down. Let me get this piece right here. Because this piece, I don't like how this piece is laying. Let's redo you back, girl. What did we just do? Okay. <laughs> I was about to say, what the heck just happened? Oh my gosh, y'all, my hair looks so cute. What? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> okay, TikTok, y'all know a little Sean. A little Sean, Sean, a little Sean. I'll give y'all that. Y'all ate that one little thing right there. And this is the hair oil that I've been using, this wild growth oil in between protective styles and stuff like that. And I don't like to put it on my like in my hair every time I do my hair but when I go to sleep then I make sure I add it on there my freaking edge control brush is dirty I think I have another one I think I have another one please hold okay I think I had another one so this is the one I'm using and this is the edge control that I'm using edge effect and I've never even used it yet. That new edge control, baby. Hello? Release. Release. That's the only thing I don't like about having nails on. I can't freaking grab anything. And then I have braces, so I can't freaking use my teeth. break don't do it. don't get too happy on me all right so these edges mm -hmm, I know that's right y'all so we're gonna end the video here i love my hair i look so cute i look so cute what bye oops <laughs> all right y'all remember to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video period bye